Yo guys, what's going on once again? Before we get started, you're probably wondering why I'm wearing the same shirt and like the pretty much the same exact hair thing as yesterday. Well, that's because I'm recording on the same day. So that's cool, I'm recording two videos in one day. So today, we're gonna go over my top five Lego sets of all time. Now before we get started, this is pretty much an obvious choice. You guys probably know all my favorite sets by now. So let's just go ahead and get started. These are gonna go from my least favorite to my most favorite set of all time. So go ahead and do it. Now when I mean my least favorite to most favorite, I don't mean like I hate this thing a lot. I still really like this thing, but this is a Death Star coming at it at number five. This thing is great. This is the 2008 Death Star. Only thing I don't really like about it is the laser part because of how fragile it is. Like if you just barely touch it it's gonna fall apart so that's a downside to it but all in all it's a big old set it is giant it is extremely dusty because i don't have the time to like dust it and the figures are great you got the classic looking luke in the classic princess leia you got all the good stuff you got the little little thing right here the wall i forget what that's called it's a good looking set all in all you got darth vader's pod very good it's like a 3800 piece set it's a giant armor set but still like it like it like it a lot plus the framing i mean it don't look great at it like from the eye like it makes the eye sore but still really really good set number four is my most favorite set of all time this is indiana jones temple of doom the set i've been wanting for 10 years it is a amazing set it is indiana jones i got this thing a couple months ago i just love it so much you got the carts got the racetrack i mean the like the little roller coaster thing all these very very good looking figures look at those you got all of those really nice looking figures and just a really really great looking set i mean i've been wanting it for 10 years so that's a very very big side to it that makes me that makes it my most favorite set of all time i know i said my least favorite to most favorite but man this is probably my most favorite set right here temple of doom check it out in the top right corner man number three is the slave one the slave one is such an amazing set it is ginormous it is 22 inches long up and down look at that thing got the gravity assisted wings meaning they move depending on how you move it. it's like a gimbal the big old window right there is giant guns in the bottom and just a very nice looking little underside to it you could just oh man it's so good it don't look bad from a down angle because you can see lego even details the bottom side of it right there you got studs showing up it looks very very good and you got all these really really good looking figures you got han carbonite you got han solo imperial guard boba fett and a stormtrooper and it's a ucs set as well oh man number two y'all the joker's mayor the most colorful set and a really 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 good set as well it's got this really cool looking roller coaster right here pushes up the purple or blue track and then comes back the other side looks super super good looking at it from a distance you know the thing's not a not a little little toy it's a big old display piece it is giant it's 3, pieces there's all of the figures well not all the figures it's all my dc figures lined up making the thing look great is the joker's manor man if i could i would i'd bring this down but i'm too lazy for that plus i man i don't know how to get it down it's gonna be difficult but man joker's manor looking very very good oh man y'all you guys know it number one is the bugatti shiver or shower and however you call it this thing is so good looking look at that little front side it's the bugatti this is my gotta be my most favorite set of all time bugatti is my favorite exotic car got a hood it goes up and down got an exclusive serial number that's one of a kind right there you got a key to make the thing in the back go up you got these awesome eb bugatti symbol wheels right there with the bugatti name in there it's blue Blue is my second favorite color from red. Got these awesome opening doors with the great interior. Got a steering wheel inside of there as well. It's looking very, very good. Very sleek design. Um, this is probably gonna be the longest set I showed off in this video because it's actually at a good level where I can like sit down, you know, and actually be comfortable without stretching my neck 180 degrees up and like breaking my neck. Got a very nice spoiler that goes up right there. This isn't a even got these, got the little 16 engine right there 16 piston engine that moves in and out got that nice looking butt Ooh, that's a nice looking bottom that's a great rear end man that weighs 15 pounds i forget to include that in my video it's about 12 pound set uh the heaviest being this one i believe which is 16 pounds 13 8 and then like two i'm not sure pounds so yeah guys once again another short video but still those are my top five sets of all time honorable mentions are the old fishing store such a great looking set super super detailed another one would have been my boy bb8 super super cute looking guy this is a weird one hogwarts express such a great set this train is super super well done super modern looking the yellow submarine was definitely a great one 
Can't forget my little sand crawler, even though this is a smaller version everybody hates. I still love it, it's my first and only sand crawler. So let me know in the comments down below of which set of mine is your favorite and which set of yours is your favorite. List your top five down below, that'd be cool to read. And that is pretty much it for the video guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, you guys know what to do. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.